Welcome to this City Update. I'm Gavin Mac Roberts, and today I'm joined by Michelle Horn. She's a consultant that was brought in by the Fayetteville Arts Council on a very exciting project. The City and the Arts Council is teaming together to bring art and murals to key intersections and gateways to our community. Michelle, can you tell me a little bit about this project that you're working on? Great. It's been a project that's been in the making for over four years. Um, we've been able to bring a, a mural project to the I-295 Ramsey Street interchange on the north side of Fayetteville. Um, it's been an exciting project and an evolution of um, processes. We've brought together several committees, five in total, um, trying to create uh, a very open process where the public is involved um, and bringing fine art to the community. Now I understand there was a uh, call went out and many different artists were brought in and you narrowed it down to that one design. What can you tell me about that process? Sure. So JP or Jermaine Powell um, is our finalist. We had a national call uh, which brought in 14 applicants. The finalist um, actually resides here in Fuquay Varina, not too far um, from this project. So we're really excited um, to have somebody locally supporting the, supporting the project and creating the work. Um, he has been working in mural arts across our state for quite some time. Now what's next in the process? I imagine you just can't go out and just start slapping paint up on the, uh, the walls of the intersection. No, we have to um, take some additional steps. Uh, we've already been through five committees and we now have to go before the North Carolina Department of Transportation's Aesthetic Committee, making sure that we're just creating a space that's safe along the roadways and is compliant with their standards. Now once you get that final approval, how long is it going to take for the mural to be completed once it's started? So the painting process will take about eight weeks. Uh, the artist will be working along the roadside in a safe manner. Uh, we hope to have some additional support, um, some student artists helping um, him to create this space. It's over 5,000 square feet of painted surface. Here's some of the concept art of what it's gonna look like when it's all done. I'm really excited to see this as you're coming off the off ramp of 295 into a major gateway into the city. Why is a project like this so important for a community like Fayetteville? Well, corridors um, and gateways into communities set a, the stage uh, for a place where you live, work, and play. And so it creates a sense of pride for those that live there, but it also creates a sense of uh, aesthetic uh, awareness uh, when visitors are coming to, to uh, enjoy our community. Michelle, I want to thank you for sharing about this exciting project. I'm really excited to be able to come in off of uh, the interstate and see that beautiful mural painted there at I-295. And I want to thank you for joining us, and I want to thank you for watching.